What's up, everybody? How you guys doing? This is terrible. We are we are uh, as this close as we can possibly get. Yeah. You're, you're almost we're, off. Get in here, buddy. Get in here, buddy. Get in here, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh, can you guys hear us hey okay? Guys. How is it? Uh, I know it's a little. <laughs> it's a little <laughs> echoey. Yeah. It's a little echoey in here. Whatever. It's quiet. It's fine. No, we're good. Is it quiet? Can you guys hear us? You guys can hear us okay. Yeah. Meter wise, looks okay. I can turn it up. We can crank it a little bit. Oh, it's weird. Do you want to slide there the slider up over there? Yeah, the, the camera's here. Check, oh, check, yeah, check. we should have flipped them so the chat was closer to the camera. Yeah, Dang yeah, it. Yeah. What do you want? What do you want? You can uh, still do that. Bring up the mic a little bit, the first slider there. Just bring it up a How notch or two. Talk hello, hello, this check. Camera, one, this two. Camera, this camera. Tell them what you're doing. <laughs> oh, you researched this. You watch Sean Evans? I'm so proud of him right now. <laughs> I'm so proud of him right I'm now. All right, hold I'm on. Bob Gurr here. So. Everybody, <laughs> let's, let's do a disclaimer really quick. So Impulse and I did this not too long ago on the podcast. I'm sure a lot of you saw it. And it was brutal. It was brutal, but when it was done, I want to be fully honest here. When it was done, I was like, dude, I didn't think I was going to get through that. That was brutal, but not as bad as I thought it was going to be. And then we yeah. really thought about it. We think, <laughs> we think that we prepared them, and the way we prepared them oh, by yeah. baking them pulled the heat out. We could be wrong. Yeah. It might be the same thing here, but we really kind of revamped it. Impulse, take us through exactly the how process. We did. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. So first of all, we switched to actually bone-in wings. Instead of so don't popcorn. touch your eye. Yeah. Oh, you so did we did boneless. We did. We did popcorn chicken. You weren't there. I you know anything? I'm, I'm, I'm already making fun. Oh, boneless. Yeah. So right. We did. Well, there were popcorn chicken. We had forks so that we didn't have to touch them because our biggest ah. concern was touching the wings and then touching our eyeballs. No, no. Listen, I, if I don't have it curtains. in my beard, that's a fail. <laughs> yeah, well, I know. Yeah. We all have beards, so this is gonna get ugly. Yeah. yeah. Um, so yeah, first of all, we got the bone-in wings this time. Uh, marinated them overnight, so the built, room already reeks. Yeah, we have we had eleven because there's actually eleven sauces this time because we have two different versions of Dabam, which we'll get to in a minute. Uh, so we took all 10, 11 wings in eleven containers, put all the sauce in, shook them up, coated them well, and let them sit overnight so it soaked it in. And then this morning, uh, reheated the wings and coated them again. So <laughs> they are. They are like triple weird. coated. They're, in they're sauce. wet. How about that? They're, they're wet. They're actually wet. Yeah. I, this yeah. Is I, I, I have to admit I didn't watch the other one when they did it, so this is all new to me. Yeah. yeah. I kind of once they invited me to do this, I was like, all right, well, I don't want to watch the other one now, but I didn't watch it before either. So. This is what you might call overcorrecting. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so no we wanted to make sure that we did it as properly as Come we could. This way. I want to get Tango more centered. Okay. I'm sorry. It's just we're fine. We're fine. Just a little. There we go. There right. we go. We're, all right. Get more centered with the screen. Oh, and the other thing was, okay, so when you buy the Hot Ones Season 21 sauce from theheatness.com, they send you this version. Of Da Bomb, and it's called Da Bomb Evolution. It's like um, the kitty version, it's like apparently. it's like they just felt like we can't do that to our customers. It's not fair to them or something. And this is the one Skiz and I did on the podcast. Since then, I have been able to purchase the actual Da Bomb Beyond Insanity. So what we're gonna do? The reason why there's 11 wings is because we're gonna do both of them uh, and compare. Oh. So we're gonna so do the bomb world. evolution, like and then to we're back. gonna do yeah, I like that. yeah. Like so that. we get to compare them back That's to good. back. I like it. Why don't see. you do me a favor? Mention that you cannot read the left screen, if you would. Yeah. Yes. So um, as far as like, I see that there's a hype train going off because it's in the chat. I see that Sam is gifting way too many gift subs. Thank you, Sam, so much, and I'll let it as well. I uh, caught that, but I literally have no way of acknowledging uh, any of the bits and the subs and the things that go on. So what we'll try to do is like at the end of the stream. Uh, I'll, I'll grab it and or I'll pull it up on my phone at least so that we can acknowledge all that. So please don't feel bad if you're you know doing the thing, and I will be sharing some of this love with these guys. Uh, mm -hmm. So we do appreciate it. So two questions: one, are our wives watching? I have no idea. I encourage mine too. And then someone oh, just no. asked if I was streaming and. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm here. Right there. <laughs> I'm at Impulse's house, so it's hard for. Yeah, me we didn't really have a good way to like. <laughs> Get all three streams going at the same time. Yeah, my wife is fantastic. Right uh, Can you imagine if my wife brought it up in her classroom? Right oh now? my gosh! <laughs> it's because they want to see the tattoo. Oh, the tattoo! Uh, That's so uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's there's, right there's, there. your, there's your thumbnail. Cool. You like Live to create. I love Nooch. it. I love it. <laughs> all right. Uh, uh, okay, so <clears> the format. One, we're gonna have one person who asks a question. The other two are gonna answer it. But the yeah. way it's gonna work is, let's say I'm the one asking the question. I'm gonna I'm gonna eat, and as I'm eating, Impulse is gonna take us through that specific sauce. Yeah, I have all the info about yeah. what we are actually putting in our mouth. 
Uh, so we'll go through like the Scoville heat units and stuff. The SH units. Uh, if, if you didn't see the Imp and Skiz podcast where him and I actually did all these sauces one time, um, we talked about the fact that the Taco Bell fire sauce is rated 500, 500. Uh, Scoville heat units, SHUs. This is like <laughs> and a million. <laughs> we're starting at 1600. Uh, this one's actually not rated. <laughs> it's so high on the school uh, scale so, that they couldn't even rate as it. As someone who's never done, I've always been a spicy guy. I've always liked spicy food, but I've never done a test like this. Like, compare number one to I go to the, the wing place and say, "Give me your spiciest wings." Yeah, it's one's right. not that bad. Okay, one no, actually, okay. one's I not that. So bad. we're not starting well, with fire. I would we're say if you went to you know whatever Buffalo Wild Wings or whatever. Yeah. Um, which, by the way, these are actually from Buffalo Wild Wings, so we got B-dubs here. Uh, B-dubs. I would say probably this guy is where it starts is to about match. about where, where it starts to okay. match. Right. And so what is so that? Number five. Yeah. Yeah. Los so Calientes Rojo. First half is like, mm, flavor. Oh, nice yeah. Chipotle blend. Mm. Blah, blah, blah. And then yeah. here's just like where the tears start rolling. And I just want to say... Played up, if you're listening, wings might be a good addition. To the game. Let's do, let's get some wings on there. Yeah, man. we were just a few minutes late because we were having to having to get this all laid out and everything. So are you ready? Um, yeah. Shall we get started? I'm gonna eat. <laughs> I'm gonna, so you want me to start and then ask the question? <clears throat> Tango needs to speak up a little bit. Tango always needs to speak up a little bit. Just yeah, I try to talk. We have one boom uh, mic, one unfortunately, mic, yeah. so we have to like. I tried to center it so that they would look in. And, and yep. Okay. Okay. Um, so Skiz is Skiz is gonna start us off with the hot ones, the classic chili maple. Like I said, sixteen hundred SHU. Uh, this is a, a classic hot one sauce that they brought back. Uh, it, it's gonna lure us into a false sense of security with its sweet and slightly spicy blend of real maple syrup and Fresno chill chilies. Maple syrup. And we're just getting started. Mm -hmm. uh, we're just getting started. So now, uh, as Skiz prepares to ask, ask me a question, I'm gonna dig in as well. All right. All right. Here's a question. For both of you, that was tasty. Mm. You've seen The Matrix. Tango, have you seen The Matrix? Because I don't know if you know what yeah. a TV is. All right. Um, <laughs> I love The Matrix. It's such a great, good. great, mm. great movie. Name is right. And the yeah. idea that they can port into the back of their uh, brains like that and just learn stuff. What are two skills? You only get two. Two skills that you would love to go onto the Nebuchadnezzar Ooh. in The Matrix, plug in, and get that skill right away. Yeah. I know one. I'm Holy trying to think of what my second one would be. Two skills? You only get two, homie. Oh my gosh. What's the limitation of these skills? Are they <laughs> are they things a human could normally do, or do I get like superpowers? Right. Oh, that's fair. It's, 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 it's what it's an actual real skill <clears throat> that a human can do. Okay. Yeah. You come in hot with these questions, just, man. Just like the movie. Right, right. first, my he first comes one, in with the hardest question I've ever had to answer. My first away. one, straight up, is I would I would become the best hockey player. The best hockey Ooh. player, he says. Ooh. The best hockey player. I would love that. Ooh, yeah. I like that. Okay. Hey, man, he loves hockey. I love hockey. I love that. I'm going to go with drumming. I want to be better than Ella Stefario. Even with the Nebuchadnezzar plug-in, it's not going to happen. Shut up. <laughs> mean. <laughs> rude. For anybody. So rude. No, that's good. So that's rude. Good. And, okay. then, and then the other one is, you know, I've always had a fascination with carpentry. So, like, becoming, like, the best carpenter okay. on the planet would actually be really cool. Very good. You can craft your own He's drums. so rude. One more. I don't have a good one right now. So, and the only dumb one that's coming to my head, it's just a simple... Like, just to be able to read ridiculously fast or something. Really? Just it feel, feels read. like that would be interesting. Mm, yeah. My that way, because I hate wasting time really on cool. that, and I'm not that fast. I'm not slow, but I'd love to be able to just look at something and be like, yep, got it. Next, yeah. move on, you know? Yeah, my wife is stupid fast reader. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to tell you this. <sighs> the first time Skiz and I did this. Shout out for Neil Peart. Love it. Uh, this <laughs> this wing felt like it had zero heat. Uh, the first the one. The first yeah. time we did. Like can, can we just say the first one, by the way, was... No, it's good. It's, it's not tasty. bad. No. Not bad but at all. flavor. you feel a little bit a little of ting bit, on yeah. this, right? Yeah. yeah. And I don't remember feeling even that little bit of ting the first yeah. the first time we no. did it. Just, I'm, with, I'm with you. So, so this is already... Worried. I'm scared. Because yeah. the first one had no heat the first time we right. did it. This time I'm like, this. I can. Yeah. it's not bad. I can and I have to say, you'll know when we get to the ones that are spicy because I will start hiccuping. And I'm going to run to the bathroom over and over again and blow my nose. I love spice, but once I have any kind of spice, it's like... Uh, yeah, so that's gonna that's gonna yeah. happen. Yeah, I didn't call my wife stupid. My wife is stupid fast. <coughs> She's a stupid fast reader. My wife's a stupid fast. Did he reader. just call his wife stupid? <laughs> she, he knows this is being recorded. She's right? the furthest thing from stupid. All right. Oh, uh, do I have to eat? Okay. So he's moving on to the second one. This is called the La Primentari. Uh, yeah. This is remember that the the SHU on the previous one was sixteen hundred. We're popping up to six thousand. So Six five thousand. times as much, almost five times as much. Yeah, that's a good jump. Four that's times a, as much. That's a yeah, okay. Great jump. And we're not we're not like 
cleaning the wings or no, anything like no. that. Don't touch your eyes. I didn't, did I? I, almost I mean, did. if they're good, I'm, I'm going to clean the wings because I'm kind of... All right. Can't we, now we eat. I'm going to bring things down a little bit from the, the heavy question that Skiz did. I'm going to keep this heavy. one. It was heavy. Mm. Like, it made me think. Um, <laughs> what was your favorite cartoon as a child? Mm. Mm. Who wants to go first? I will. Well, favorite good. cartoon as a child. Chat, go ahead and put yours in chat as well. Let's see them. Are you ready? Garfield. Garfield? All day long. No, hold on. Okay. All right. I love the Garfield and Friends show. Loved it. But the seasonal stuff. Like the Christmas one and stuff like mm. that. And the Thanksgiving one. Okay. Like they were just, I think there was a Thanksgiving one. But I just, I was a huge Garfield fan. Love Garfield. Ooh, I swallowed that. And I... Yeah, yeah, a little bit of yeah, a little bit. Not until I swallow yeah. yeah. That's this is going to be so much worse. worse. I know, I can't wait, I can't <laughs> oh wait. Oh my gosh, we overcorrected. All right. So I'm a straight up Looney Tunes guy. I've always been a Looney okay. Tunes addict. I love Looney Tunes. <clears throat> if I had to break it down, anything with Foghorn Leghorn or Yosemite Sam. Yeah, I love Yosemite Those Sam, Those two guys dude. are great. Nice. Not that like creating a cartoon character that just fired me. Yeah, <laughs> just, just the most <laughs> iconic individual ever. Yeah. yeah. That is good. Yeah. That is good. Okay. Um, now, whew. next. Oh, I eat and then read, right? Yeah. Is that how this works? Yeah, yeah. I, I will, uh, I'll cover you. Number three. We, we didn't want to have like this time where it was just silence and it's all chewing. Yeah. So we came up with a little bit of a method that we can talk a little bit while he's eating. Um, so Tango's digging into our, <laughs> our third wing already called the Krabby Shack. It's a zesty lemon pepper. 15,500 SHU is what we're up to. Um, Very lemony. It's uh, tangy. Tom tomato, tomato, til tomatillo? What the heck is tomatillo? Tomatillo. Tomatillo? Yeah. I never heard of that before. Like you go to Chipotle, you know. Tomatillo? Tom Tom I Tio. never heard of that. Yeah. Lemon pepper magics with yeah. seafood. Lemon okay. pepper. That was you, you feel like some are eating from Tango. Very, very good lemon pepper. Yeah, we didn't yeah. want this chewing it noises and that's it. That's so delicious. we gotta dig oh, in as well. That was delicious. Okay. Yeah, this is one of my Oh, I gotta ask you guys questions now. Hmm. These have been sitting here long enough, they're all cold by now. That's fine, that's fine. But there's the temperature cold. Yeah, they're temperature cold, spicy hot. This one, I think, is my oh. favorite as far as like sauce goes. I'm actually gonna clean this one. <clears throat> all right, you're gonna love this one because it's gonna make you think. All right, thanks. I'm gonna eat all day. It's good. All right, guys, this is for both of you. Really good. If you had to teach something new to a brand, to a something new to a room full of strangers, Ooh. what would it be? Ooh, very good. Teach something new to now. Is it a skill set I have to be proficient in? That's that's the whole point of the question, I think. Yeah. Okay. Like, what do you feel most qualified? No, to no, 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 no. Meaning, I'm currently proficient in that skill set. Do or they play I, Minecraft? <laughs> no, no time to prepare. Can, right. Can I? Can I go in, straight? In ten minutes, you're gonna go do this. Yeah. Can I go straight to Redstone? Is that weird? <laughs> no. Because I, I I really feel like I I would have fun teaching Redstone yeah, to, kind of to newbies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I my mine would be public speaking. Because I know what people are so. Teach? I want to attend my class. I have methods. I have I have oh. tricks like tricks for the, like. There's many people I've known who are about to go to do a speech and then I counsel them a little bit and I give them a, a little trick. One of them is the bird's eye view stuff like that. Um, when you know, pull yourself out of the situation, realize how small it actually is. Another one is actually convince yourself that they're the ones who are lucky to be there to watch you. You know what I mean? They yeah, came yeah, to see you. Yeah, 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 they came to see you. They're here to see you. It's a confidence like they're, thing. Yeah, they're the ones who are lucky, so relax. I want to go to that class. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Yeah. Let's not, let's just pause here. Go ahead, give it the class. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I was going to do it. Yeah. yeah I, know. I almost you, scratched you, my eye. You were going to jump right in. I, I did. I, I like went up to touch, yeah. like right here. It kind of got itchy. Too close. And and I got really close. Yeah. It's right. All right, now you Under the answer. eye. Answer. Under the eye. Oh, I have to answer too? No, I already said it. Redstone. He gave the easy answer. Who okay. gave the easy answer? All right, fair enough. I thought you were <laughs> joking. All right. <laughs> I mean, obviously drumming as well. Look, they like, want a TED talk with Skiz. That's a bucket list item for me, folks. I would, to do I'll go, I'll go, I'll go further. I'll, I'll give more examples, because Redstone was a, a, an easy answer. Um, we taught drumming before, so obviously that's, that's easy too. Um, I think <clears throat> you guys know I'm in love with like technology and like uh, gadgets. Yeah. I think I would I would I would like to teach people how like audio video technology for ah, streaming works. Very yeah. good. 
Like Eric that's a, that's a channel I've and been wanting to create, just yeah. no time to do it. And you, that's without good, yeah. knowing, you're a very, very, very good teacher. You've had to teach me a lot of stuff, and you're and when I'm done, I'm like, you have like a knack for it, taking stuff that's really complicated and giving like really quick metaphors to get it in quick. You're good at it, man. It's making me blush. Uh, that's the no, it's the, it's the heat. It's the right. heat. I'm sweating. Already. Next one. Um, so oh. I'm going to eat. You talk to them about number four. Oh, uh, he's okay. about to consume. The chili <coughs> lingua, no, I can't pronounce it. The Chico Ghost. Uh, <laughs> it's a Honduran sauce. Basically, it's chip earthy chipotle and chocolate ghost pepper with ginger and panela sugar. It's 36,500 SHU. So remember, we started at 1,600. We're already up to 36,500. Uh, this one's actually different. It's, it's way different. Uh, it's a different taste than most hot sauces, and I like it because it's kind of got like a chocolatey to it. But you said the magic word there. You said ghost pepper. It's good, yeah, as soon as you said that's, that. That's no joke, yeah. My brain opened up the ghost pepper archive and got ready for it. Okay, here's your question. Horse, pig, or sheep? You gotta pick one as a pet. What you picking as a pet? Horse. Are you? I think horse, I, I, I really feel like and not, not that I've had a lot of experience with horses, but I really feel like from what I've seen, horses just have a, a connection. They they uh, they're very like close to human, almost like you. I don't know. They just seem like they're very smart, very loving. <clears throat> if you take care of them, right? I don't know. I think I would make most connection with a horse. Okay. Am I? <laughs> I got, yeah, I got it. I love it. I got it. I love it. I love it so much. Is this is this animal raised from birth, or am I am I rent rent renting this animal? Like, you get it. Am I from, acquiring it from a farm? You get it from birth, and it is your pet. Pig. Are you? See, yeah. I, I know somebody who owns a pig. He loves it. I pig. think a pig would be cool, but I don't want some, you know. I don't want all the nasty that comes with pig. I just want like the dog pig who yeah. just like walks around the house. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, you got a pig. Don't give him any mud. Yeah. Yeah. Poor sheep. Man, they'll look like, like hey, I'll make you a jacket once a yeah. season. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what more do you want? <laughs> I give you myself. <laughs> That's a good one, isn't it? Do you like that? Do you like the chocolatey? I've loved all these so far. Yeah, they're really good. Yeah. That one was tasty, and it was a good amount of spice. This one's starting to hit. Yeah. I think number and three the, was the spicier lemon than number was four. Good too. I think three was spicier than four. Really? Oh, wait, no, no. I think two was spicier. <laughs> lips, lips are starting to get the tingle. Yeah. yeah, here's the thing. Like, The first half is... Definitely enjoyable, I think, as it picks up. Where are we? Or did we just do this? No, we're about we to. Okay. We're about to get awful. Hey, listen, also, one Here other clarifying thing. Another thing we kind of messed up on when we did the podcast is that we had shakes during. The yeah. rule is you need to save them for after. So they're in the fridge. We can't touch them until we're done. But we can have water or milk anytime. Right? Yeah. I have water or milk I'm anytime. Right I've and that. I'm going to try to make it one more. I want to at least make it through the first half. I'm going to try and go the whole thing without it. Milk, I think. The last time I drank milk was at your house the first time I met you. Why did you drink milk at my house? Because there was, uh, there was some sort of thing I had to do on stream where I had to oh. like, eat a... And then I yeah. went to the restaurant. Generally come to my house, I'm going to do stupid things. Yeah, yeah. and Mrs. Tomato <laughs> was holding a glass of milk. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, let me check something real quick. Haunted Knight, are you here? Raise your hand if you're here. Uh, and if you're able to do something. Just get some table. Um, oh, so we have prepared three questions each which is nine questions, and we actually have 11 wings. Uh, so what we would like right now is to chat, have chat start submitting their questions. <clears throat> and Haunted, I'm gonna leave this up to you 100%. I trust Excellent. you. Try to pull the best two questions out of what everything you see, and, and then you're gonna ask those to us from the ones you pull. I'm gonna trust your judgment, Haunted. Not Minecraft related. Yeah, I'll, I'll, <laughs> fine. I'll stay away from my Minecraft yeah. question too. Then. No, I got um, one. Oh, you got a Minecraft I question. Got one. I did. Yeah. I have oh, a Minecraft. Right, I got one. So yeah, if you have a good question, pop it in chat. Haunted's gonna try to read chat and uh, pull two of the best ones that Haunted finds, and then uh, I don't know which wing we're gonna say. Give us your first one or not, Haunted? No pressure. You know, it's, it doesn't have to be like the most <laughs> amazing question ever. No pressure. We just need um, it in ten. But yeah, minutes. go ahead, guys. We want you. To, we want you to be part of this as well. So. Um, so now it's your question. So I have to eat. First, now. So now we're moving on to number five. Uh, the five, this is called Los Calientes Rojo. I'm glad you're the one pronounced it this time, because last time apparently I didn't pronounce it very, very well. And, uh, and I got, you guys, Los I got, I got slaughtered in the comments. Rojo. No. This is where it gets real. Next apparently. one. Next yeah. one. Next one. Okay. Okay, so this is 49,000 SHU. 
This is, uh, this is, what does this say? We have the sauce of summer's hotter cousin, AKA Los Calientes Rojo. Sweet apricot mixes with oh. fruity habaneros and a hint of human. Mm. I thought you just said a hint of human. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got dark. Oh. All right, let's go top. So, <clears throat> top. <laughs> yeah, that one actually did hit the back of my throat, and I'm feeling it. We're okay, here we go. This is another. I'm throwing you guys softballs. I'm. I'm I, I, apparently, I decided to come up with easy questions. In your opinion, what is the best candy bar, and why? Mm. Try to convince me mm. that you're right. Oh wow. Best candy bar. Chat, feel free to tell us yours. I don't eat a lot of candy bars. I'm eating this whole wing. On the night's like, wait, they're already spamming questions. Don't have them say other stuff. Huh. <laughs> this is a good one, dude. Uh, I feel like the best candy bar is one that's... The most famous. Well, but it's one that I don't eat a lot or something. I I've know. Had, and I was like, wow, that was really good. Mm. I'm going to say Snickers. Because <sighs> it just... It satisfies. It, it does. <laughs> it's the perfect amount of all the different, it's got, you know, with the, the caramel and the chocolate and then the nuts inside, it sounds like I'm doing a commercial for it, but the nuts actually, I don't I'm, I don't have a sweet tooth, and the nuts inside there, like, they actually kind of taper off how sweet it is and it just gives a perfect balance for me. Yeah. I like Snickers. I think Snickers is I wouldn't put good. it number one, but I like Snickers. Would you put it number one as well? You, uh, you taking his answer? Or no, you, no, no, Are you no. copying off I mean, it is paper? one that pops from my mind. I do, I do like it. You know, when I was a kid, it was like Halloween. I was like... Yeah. yeah. I assume we're not counting things like Reese's Pieces because that's not a candy bar. I say that's okay. Because that's, that's, that's what I'm going. I did say now. candy really? bar. Let's let's retract the bar part. Go ahead, any candy. Okay. Then, any candy. Then definitely Reese's Pieces. Reese's Pieces is good. Cup. It is nice. Oh, uh, butter cup. The, 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 the cup. The, the old school cup. Oh, yeah. I like the pieces. Butter cup. Um, I like the crispy shell. We got the little more crispiness to it. Yeah. yeah. No, the, their peanut butter, something about it is just. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest, this is already ten times worse than than when you and I did the podcast. Yeah, payday. Should, I was gonna say I was gonna say payday. Just if I had to stick with candy bar. Payday is payday's a, a lot of nut. A lot of nuts. A lot of nut going on. I like uh, <laughs> I, I really like uh, caramel, so I, I would go with Twix. Oh, okay. I like Twix I, too. I really like Twix. Twix is good. Plus is you good. get plus you get two of them. Kit Kat is good. You get both. Genius marketing, you get two of them. Yeah, yeah. The left one's always Kit the better Kat, one though. Dude. Everyone knows the left Twix is the better one. Kit Kat gets you four. It, you break them apart. Yeah, yeah. but you ever eat like a Kit Kat they, like if, they, if they come together, that counts as one. That's one nacho. All right, so you're <laughs> up top. Whoo! Oh, you're up top. What am I doing? You're gonna eat the spicy eat shark. Ass. Eat the ass. The Mako snake. The seventy-one thousand SHU. Love it. Oh. Another newcomer to the wings of doom. The spicy shark brings brings masala vibes to the number six wing with coconut, cumin, <laughs> cinnamon, and droppage. Oh, <laughs> cardamom, Missy coriander, Roo. and Cinnamon, very cinnamony. Carolina Reapers and Ghost Pepper contributing to a lingering. I need to heat. hire somebody to come scratch my eyes. A lingering heat. Oh, baby. Oh, no. We oh, baby. Cinnamon is very strong. Uh, that's tasty. It's got some kick, though. Mm. Yeah, my tongue is not happy right now. This is a lot of cinnamon. I oh. have the cinnamon, though. <laughs> it's just burp. <laughs> this one might, I might be done with the double bites. I've been doing. Did you guys taste the cinnamon in that, though? Yeah. Like, it's still got flavor. We're not at just pure pain. Uh... <coughs> Speak for yourself. With the pain part. <laughs> yeah. Um, now we're down to one bite. That's, yeah, that's I was yeah. I wasn't trying to clean the wing. Uh, there was no there was no discussion of like, we have like, to clean. They wings. don't they don't polish it on the show. <clears throat> I was at least trying to get two bites out of each one of these. Ask a question. I'm I'm done with the yeah. two bites thing now. Question time. That was good. Oh, that was good. oh, it's my question. Yeah. Tango is killing it. He's good with spice. Tango's, we'll see. We'll Tango's see. good with spice. Okay. If you could go, this might get a little bit deep. I was gonna oh, say, all right. Do it. If you can go back to one day in your life and relive it or change it, what day would it be and what would you do? Oh my goodness gracious. Just had it. I, my first full <coughs> day in Morea at the resort. Uh, it was perfect weather. Uh, the, the skies were were blue. That's the, when you're out yeah. of like Fiji or whatever. Right? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It was in Woo! it was in uh, that looked amazing. The French Polynesian Islands, right across from Tahiti. The weather was absolutely perfect. The ocean was calm. You could see the water all the way down to the bottom to the coral reef. 
Uh, we had just the newness of walking into this resort was just right then. Uh, so everything was just like a fantasy. And if I could relive that day over, but not only that, like still have that newness feeling every day, then I would want to be stuck in that day forever. That was that was the most amazing, amazing trip ever. Uh, I have, <clears throat> it's like three different days that are all kind of the same thing. And it's hard for me to choose one. One would mm -hmm. either be when my daughter saved uh, her team's undefeated season by hitting a walk-off. That was a walk-off home run. I remember you told us about oh, that. Like, it was the most your heart run. must have just been like exploding it, it was with pride. Yeah. To literally be yeah. down by two, two, two runners on and her yeah. knock it out to, to, for a walk-off was sick. <clears throat> uh, it might be the time I caught my daughter's home run ball, which was <laughs> that was crazy. Um, or when my son won his karate tournament as a kid. Oh, that was really like watching him take down the, the last kid and win first place. That was awesome. That was amazing. super cool. So that was on well, Taekwondo. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I, I can't choose. It's my kid. So it's like that's that's yeah. it's the same dynamic, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. That's good. Skin's touching our hearts. I'm, gonna, I'm not crying because he said that. I'm crying because it hurts. <laughs> Excuse me, where are you He's going, Skiz? Come on. He's gone. Quick, hey, get your butt back over here. We got a tissue boy over here. In fact, can you hand me one? <laughs> We're tapping out. We're Look, just getting warmed I just, up. I just, I, just, I just need a clean, I just need to be able to touch my eyes because I actually <clears throat> am. It is starting to, this is, for me, it comes out my eyeballs. I just had to blow my nose. When All right. When, it, when the heat happens. Um, um, should we should we see if we if Haunted was able to grab a good question sure, for us? Sure, sure. Break into okay. that. Yeah. What do we got? We got one. Let's see. Haunted, are you ready, or do you need more time? Were you able to pluck pluck a good one? I had to get a clean tissue to touch my <laughs> eyes. Let's see. Let's give Haunted a chance. Sometimes Haunted is on multiple, oh, and I call him out, and he's just like, oh, "Here we go." I'm on bubble. There it is. Okay, so the question is, what do you love the most about the other two? two? Oh, wow. Okay, we gotta eat the wing though. God, we gotta eat the wing. Who wants to? Who wants to? Skiz, you read. We are on number seven. <clears throat> you want me to read? Okay. And so Tango number and I seven is the Harapeno Chico. One hundred and three thousand SHU. Making sauce is a family affair for the folks at Auto Baloco. I don't know if that's right. The Hawaiian hot spot, or I'm sorry, the Hawaiian hot sauce legends kick up the spice factor with the super smoky jalapeno and scorpion pepper blend. Oh, oh scorpion pepper, that makes that just sounds great. Yeah. That yeah. warms my heart. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll, I'll go first. Obviously, you know, Skiz and I have been friends for 25 years or something crazy like that. And uh, what I like about Skiz is, is he can, he can see when your ship is not right, <laughs> you know what I mean? When your ship is just go, drifting in the wrong direction You're gonna take all my answers and uh, is able to help you get it back to steering it correctly, steering it right, without, and this is, a, this is the part that, that I love about him, without making you feel bad about yourself. Yeah. Um, like, he, he really sheds a certain light on it that is like, hey, dude, your ship's going the wrong way. I get it, I totally understand how that could happen. Here's, here's what I think you should do to correct it and, and all that stuff. And you feel like uh, just appreciative yeah. of him being there to save you from going the wrong <clears throat> direction. Wow. Do you want to give yours and, and, then, I'll, and then we'll give yeah, you Yeah, I mean, we, get, we could do a, an hour long podcast on Skiz. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just Skiz and how amazing of a human being he is. Like there's, listen, I don't want to blow too much smoke, but like yeah. there's very few people I've met in my lifetime that are as genuine and as nice and as... Giving, I guess, not in a sense of materials, but a sense of time and emotional effort and stuff. Like, <clears throat> hold on, <laughs> that would hurt. Yeah, this one, this one. Uh, okay. You're just there for everyone. Like, I feel like you put yourself last, always, and that just—it's well, it's amazing. That. No matter who you're with, no matter how Super much you know the person, you are just there for them, and you're willing to—you just give. That's all you do is give, and it's amazing. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you for that. Jeez, what is this? What's happening? <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go because I want to okay. move on. Um, for impulse, honestly, I love this. For impulse, it's that I can I can rely on you like at any time. Like we talk about how we use the word Houston, and it's funny that we're talking about this because Tango, you don't even like this is going to be news to you, but like we him and I had something go on this morning that he helped me with. So I just got back from New York yesterday, long flight home. We went to Philly, had to come home, and then we hit East Economy, and we're just exhausted. My wife and I are like, okay, let's get home. That was an emotional three days moving our daughter into her apartment in New York. Let's just get home, get on the car at East Economy Parking, 
won't start we're like oh that's super uh, so i had to have the, the so so it's just the so the hot here you yeah. park your yeah. car out in the yeah. in a I, parking I like, lot i feel like that east sun. economy lot has had more dead batteries than yep. any other place in the yep. state exactly because they, they sit there for four days and they bake and they bake and that's they bake right. and after a week it's like ah, yeah. ah, just kidding so the second it didn't happen i was just like okay they have a plan for this because this happens all the time it has to yeah i yeah. found a number i called them they're like yeah we got you the guy came out for a jump like the crew there <laughs> The and guys, there's like a pit crew there. Do they just come out in their suits? Yeah. A hundred percent. In yeah. fact, two rows over, I saw another family dealing with the same thing. Yeah. Oh, and uh, the guy, I said, you got to have a big, uh, big battery day. He's like battery month. Yeah. He's like, it's out of control. Whoa. So anyways, so that was good. So I come home and I figure it was a, it was a dead battery, but that drive home, which is a decent clip, is going to charge it and all that should be fine. And then this morning, my wife goes to leave. I get up early. I'm like, I got to, I want to listen to how it starts and it doesn't turn over. So she took the other car. And I hit up <clears throat> Impulse, and I'm like, listen, this is what I got going on. I need to go to AutoZone. He's like, yeah, no problem. And he comes over with a charger, which, by the way, I got to get take out of my car. It's in my car. Oh, okay. Comes over with a charger, <laughs> gets me jumped. He's like, take my charger and just, you know, go get your battery, whatever. Yeah. But it was just like this, this like safety net that is always, always there. I try not to abuse it. It must feel like I abuse it, but it's always there. <laughs> you were yeah, safe. You, were, you, yeah. were, you had a moment of, oh, crap, and he came through. That's yeah, cool. he did. Now you talk about Impulse. <laughs> like, sorry guys, I got nothing. Uh, I, mean, I, got, I, got, I haven't said anything good about him either yet. Yeah. So, uh, wow. So how, we've known going on seven, probably seven or eight, eight years. Eight, yeah, even more. I think. Yeah. Yeah. No, the thing, the thing I love about MP is his dedication to his craft. Like he's never done. He's never done. He's like no matter no matter what he's doing, he always wants to be better at it. Whatever it is. Yeah. Whether it's YouTube, whether it's audio video setup, whether it's MCC or anything, it's just like he he has this never ending insatiable appetite to be better at something, and that's respectable. Yeah. Thank you. Agreed. Yeah. Uh, for for Tango, I think Tango. I rely on Tango to like years, to yeah. help me make decisions that uh, I'm emotional about because I know Tango. He's a really brilliant guy, and he's like able to do all the equations and figure everything out, and and he's able to leave. <laughs> emotion out of decision making when I need when I need him to because a lot of times decisions are hard I struggle with decision making and so anytime I'm like Tango I don't know if I should do this or if I should uh, say yes to this person that's asking for whatever and and Tango is always able to just like steer me the right way <coughs> by like logic based decision making well, and I rely on you heavily for that because like it is hard to keep emotion out of the business yeah you know yeah. and you're I, I, able to as an outsider uh, take emotion out and help me make decisions. I think so. that goes both ways. I mean, over the we both started from scratch trying to figure out how to do this craziness, and we helped each other so much. We were, yeah. We've been each other's sounding board for ten years. Now. Yeah. Like, we, we, I, I'm we, thinking of this. Does this sound dumb? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I wouldn't we, do that. We know? have talked each other off the ledge. Yeah. Per, not the literal ledge, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Many times <laughs> where it's, we're just having like mental thing. meltdowns because something didn't go our way, and it's just like, right. dude, don't worry. It's or like one this. of us will just get annoyed or get frustrated yeah. at how something's going, and the other one, the other one's there. Just be like, yeah. Hey, just, yeah. Whatever. It's, it's, been, it's just. Just move on. Yeah. yeah between it's these two, like I, I don't know, my ship always feels like it's <laughs> it's able to get corrected. So I can't imagine doing the whole YouTube stream thing in a in a in a silo in a vacuum without yeah. someone who you can just <clears throat> dang, yeah. say everything to. I mean, open up to and get advice or discuss. It's the great. first yeah. time Tango and I met in person, uh, we went to a bar and, and had a few sodas, and uh, <laughs> it it was that was our conversation. Was it is so nice to finally hang out and chat with somebody who does what I do, like in the YouTube <laughs> realm, and have that conversation because nobody else gets it or nobody else wants to even hear about it. So it is. Um, so it was it was pretty nice to uh, to have that for sure. All right, now I get to talk about Tango. Uh, <clears throat> Tango, here's the deal, bro. <laughs> Here's the deal. You bro. are <laughs> such a perfectionist, but let me expand on this. Yeah, to my own fault. Yeah. No, no, no. You are <clears throat> you are even you are you are even perfect at being a perfectionist. And what I mean by that is that perfectionists, the one thing they are, like to like universally, is they're kind of, they really are kind of annoying. But you're not. Like you're a perfectionist, but it's like tapered with this willingness to just still be flippant or whatever. You and I play games together. And then played up, I mean, like, you were just so into it being perfect. And I wanted to be good, too. But, and I do my razzing or whatever. And, like, you're not only kind of okay with it, you're fine with it, man. That's you know what I mean? So it's part. like this. Yeah. So now what ends up happening is that you partner the fact that you're a total perfectionist with the fact that you were, like, ridiculously clever. This part, I don't, I don't like the clever part about you. It, it, it upsets me, but whatever. We'll put that aside. You're, you're stupid. I'm a little angry. You're stupid, <laughs> stupid clever. And you're perfection, perfectionist. And... In my experience, just 
lovely to work with. I mean, that you shouldn't be. You should be. <laughs> like, every time I work with you, I should be a little nervous. Like, I'm going to end up upsetting him again, or I'm going to mess something up. It's ne like, every time we go to play something together, I'm like, he gets to be his perfectionist self. And I I mean, unless you're acting, I'm like, I'm not bothering him. And, and we just have this, like, amazing dynamic. Because it, on top of just <clears throat> wanting to pump out the best product you can, you're also somehow have this perfect balance of being laid back at the same time. You're a perfect perf <laughs> perfectionist. That's true. <laughs> the best part about this is we can just cry and blame it on the wings. He's exactly. Yeah, I, I know. I'm over here like, oh, it's so hot. Oh, these wings are spicy. <laughs> I'm crying out my nose. All right, what's, what's next? Oh my gosh. Okay, so here's here's the. I, I think we talked about it earlier. Uh, that when you buy this set of wings, oh they send you da bomb evolution. Are we there already? Yeah, we are oh already there. Gosh. I don't know how we've gotten so fast right, here, but I'm ready. Um, they sent da bomb. But it's evolution. It's a different model make of the bomb sauce. Uh, the bomb is well known on the actual Hot One show as being like the showstopper, the one that people just can't handle. Um, evil, but, evil notion just said this is where the fun stops, and this is where <laughs> pretty much, pretty much. But but they sent us this one, and and Skiz and I had it, and we both kind of were like, it was super high. It, yeah. it's, you know, we're gonna find out here in a second, but it just didn't really feel like the showstopper that we see when we watch Sean Evans, you know, first right, we feast right, the right. hot ones. So after we posted the 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 podcast, uh, we got some feedback, you know, that you guys didn't do the real debom. Uh, <laughs> So Ooh, we got, we do have the real debomb that we're gonna do these back to back, which is why we have eleven wings. Yeah, so we're gonna do these ones back to back, and so uh, we can actually compare and contrast. So we are gonna do debomb evolution. So, so we have so four I'm more. Eat, oh, I was supposed to be eating while you were doing. Yeah, so Skiz is gonna eat the bomb evolution. Uh, when we look at <laughs> when we look at Scoville on this one, it's one hundred thirty-five thousand. Um, so it's yeah, it's pretty good. Let me see, natural pepper heat, just a natural pepper heat. All natural sauce, equally potent, but taste. Notice, notice how they've stopped the like, whoa, with a lemony zest yeah, of yeah, yeah. cinnamon caramel doused with maple. Now they're just like, the yeah, hottest stuff we could it, throw it, in a it, bucket. It's, it's freaking hot, all right? That's pretty much where they're at now. With a pinch of cyanide. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, no. All right, here's a question, idiots. Uh oh. Here's the question. Yeah, there's no, there's no flavor anymore. That went up my nose. Yeah, this is where it actually starts to get kind of gross. All right, ready? The question is, the whole package is Minecraft content creation. It's not just content creation, it's not just Minecraft, it's the whole package of Minecraft content creation. What is the one skill in that package that you could, you wish you could greatly be better at? It could be anything that could be Minecraft based, it could be editing based, it could be performance based. Pick all the different elements from beginning to end on what a Minecraft video is or what Minecraft content creation is and what skill set do you wish you were much better at? I wish oh. I was I wish I was uh improv. <laughs> that's my answer <laughs> I mean that's the reason why That's my answer I love the life series so much is because that's what it's helping us practice mm. is uh is improv. Yeah. And that was stupid hot. Yeah this is ridiculous. I, I was, was gonna say improv, improv too. Like I wanna, improv. I wanna be scar good at improv. Oh, very good. And I wanna be, be yeah. Be Martin, B Dubs, Martin, Scar. They're all yeah. so witty. Uh, I would love to have that wittiness, and because I do yeah. think that like, yeah. I mean, it's having, got nothing to do with Minecraft. Those are the, those are the time, those are the things that make the moments that people remember. Like what we build. Uh, yeah, I mean, people may be like, oh, that build you did in season whatever was cool, but it's not gonna be that about that. It's gonna be like that hilarious mm -hmm. moment that Bodum had as we're hanging underneath the Bodum hole and blah, 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 right? It's, it's these like, these yeah. kind of like improv concepts. Uh, <coughs> and, and I'd like to just be natural at that, which is weird because it's got my, nothing my, to do with Minecraft. My friend next to me here is actually really, really good at it. At it. Yeah. Um, and so maybe that's why I latched to him, hoping it would rub yeah. off a little bit. Here I am 25 years later, still not very good. But, yes, you are. Uh, anyway, I would love to I would love to have that because I feel like the rest is like it can be can be learned. My tongue hurts. Like the editing, uh, the artisticness maybe not so much, like being able to see thumbnails for like what they you know, like make a good thumbnail. Sometimes you have to have that artistic eye. That one's not just a learn it. I think that's also like a talent yeah. as well. So anybody else feel like they just ate? I'm not cheating. I'm, I, so I, I'm literally I, blowing my nose. I that's feel like I just I, ate fire. Yeah. yeah I'm, little, I'm only blow, I'm blowing my nose. That one is, and that was the, that was the dumbed down version. I got to drink this. 
I don't like milk even. I'm, I'm still milk. sticking to the two big bites for every wing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep doing that. You are a beast, bro. Doesn't make you cooler than me. No, I know. <laughs> See, I wanna, I Skiz and I eat. did it the first time, and we were all stoic, and we're like, yeah, mm. no big deal, we got this. And then now we're just like, mm. we did that already. We felt it, dude, the first time, but this is we could, worse. We could let it out now. Okay. Yeah, no, you took my answer on improv and everything you said, I agree with. But it's got nothing to do with Minecraft, I think it's really oh, just a social skill. You know? Mm -hmm. uh, 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 hanging with a crowd of friends or semi acquaintances, the ability to just riff and be spontaneously funny or to take what someone says and oh, run with and, it and back it up yeah. with more funny <laughs> or, and, and embrace it, that's, that's, that's the skill. Okay. Yeah. I, I dig it. I might need a clean napkin. <clears throat> this thing is a mess. My wife, she she gave me, I'm like, hey, we need some cool napkins for this. She gave me white napkins. I'm like, are you sure? Yeah, no, that's Yo, good. What? That's white good, napkins? Yeah. She's like, yeah, I just Does anyone else have tears? I don't have tears, but my tongue feels like I dipped it in lava. Yeah. My tongue's actually getting oh, a little my... better now, but I have, it's I have tears like, rolling out my eyes. I'm constantly We might need a minute salivating. because the next one is <clears throat> the bomb beyond insanity. And this is, this is, this is the one I'm, I'm more afraid about this one than I am about these two. Me too. I have to, I have to. I need chapstick. It's. Why did you order the... The one, because we got made fun of. Oh, stupid! You're stupid. And you know me, I can't handle that. Oh God, what are we doing? So who's doing what? I don't know. I anymore. think Tango <laughs> asked a question. I don't know what's happening. Right what's now. happening? Tell inform me. I think. Oh, Skiz just asked a question, so it's Wait, my turn I just to... asked a question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I have to do this first. Yeah. Oh, oh no! Wait, what you want to do? What you want to do this first? Oh, it's the bomb. But it's it's the real bomb. It's the bomb beyond. Go go bomb it up. I heard up. oh I heard this is the worst possible thing you can put in your mouth ever. Bomb it up. You guys have a, a medic nearby? No, but we do have a bathroom, which is yeah. probably more important. I'm fine. It's all in the head. I'm gonna coat my uh, mouth milk real quick. My eyes are just. I, is that cheating? That's not cheating. Okay, here we go. Oh my god, I don't want to do this. I'm just going to blow my nose. I probably nose. shouldn't do that. Okay, I am gonna take a healthy bite. I'm not gonna. It's gonna take time. At first, you're like, oh, that's not so bad. Rub your eyes. Fast forward 60 seconds. Do it, rub your eyes. No! <laughs> that's all sorts of wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it doesn't taste good at all. Side note, Tango and I will be doing plate up later today from the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Can't wait. There may be some breaks. I'm death staring this wing. Okay, are you ready to ask a question? Because I don't want to do it any sooner than I need to. All right. Oh my gosh. I'm Actually, no, I'm going. Get going. Wow, oh, giant bite, it's delicious and nutritious. So, mmm, everything's great. Here we go, we'll get a little heavier. If you could pick any actor. I did too much. If you could pick any actor to play you mm. in a movie, who would it be and why? Wow. <sighs> oh gosh. What is the, what's the movie about? Oh! The Swallows were. It's a, it's a, it's like autobiography. Oh. It's a movie of you and your life. Who would, who would play uh, you? Uh, I have my answer. <coughs> it's not a very exciting movie. <coughs> yes, it is. The entire movie is just sitting behind a computer. The brilliant boy. guy behind Deck Down. Yeah. Well. Oh my God. Uh, hey, my answer is Chris Pratt. Ed Norton. Edward Norton. <coughs> Here comes the hiccup. Yeah. Like, yep. Mine's Chris Pratt. <coughs> I think he would. I, I think we have really. The hiccup. Uh, yeah. Yes. Finally! Finally! I was disappointed yeah. that Skiz did not get hiccups. I'm sweating. I'm not I don't want to talk anymore. It's just it's just wet everywhere. Yeah. I can't I can't shake the heat. It keeps getting worse. Bruce Willis? <coughs> Bruce Willis oh, is my look alike. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna do the rest of the stream from the shower. I don't even like milk and I drink most of it. Uh, I'm not cheating. I'm blowing my nose. Move it. Oh my gosh. You can point the camera over here if you want. Okay, there's a big. Okay. There's a big difference between the bomb evolution and the bomb insanity, beyond insanity. Wouldn't you say? What? I'm sorry. Oh. Yeah. That's the that's the heat moment that they they zoom into Tango's face uh, and it all goes. Yeah, that's that's the hottest wing I've ever had. Oh no! My eyes are just dripping. <coughs> Good news, the tissue broke when I put my finger on my nose. Oh, enjoy! Yeah, so that burns. Does anyone care for? Thank you. I'll take a fresh. Uh, <coughs> it's, you guys can't see it, but there's just 
on my face, and my I mean, everything is just wet. Oh god, it's uh, that's so painful, dude. Why? I got it dizzy. You guys dizzy? Yeah. That's cool. I'm gonna get through this stream and then friendship over. It sucks to breathe. I can't. My eyes are just dripping. <laughs> what are we doing next? We got two left. It sucks to breathe. It does. Air is bad. By the way, my nose is burning. Did you guys answer the question? Because I don't remember. Yep. What was the question? <laughs> I oh, kind of Ed Norton and Chris Pratt. As yeah, soon yeah. as I asked the question, I kind of blacked out. Uh, oh, I, oh. Put some. You guys put sauce in your nose the way I did. Oh, that I'm so wet. Ugh. I'm burping now. Okay, who's got the next question? I just asked, so it'd be it would be Tango. We got to get to the shakes, guys. All right. This is eat and then ask, right? So we are on to, I'm gonna pop it out. I'm gonna pop it like it's hot. Um, oh my gosh. <clears throat> Alchemy peppers, watermelon ghost, 641,000 SHU. <laughs> Dig in, Tango. Uh-oh. Don't you dare take focus off of us, Sorry. walking in front of the camera. I need water! <sighs> I still haven't taken a drink of anything. Skiz what? can't sit ah! Skiz, this, how, many this one, right? has, how many times has, yeah, how many times has Skiz gotten up? I like moving! Oh! <laughs> Tango's up as well now. Okay, so Tango's gonna dig into the alchemy peppers. Why aren't you drinking your water? First, <sighs> it's, so fun. he's, look, at he's trying to brave this the Do whole way. Do you see my face? Like, you see the You're tears? He's literally crying. I don't he know is. if the camera it's catches it. It's just tears it's from what I said. He's got an actual rolling tear down his cheek. <laughs> I am the last man city. <laughs> Show the camera. Get in there. Oh, I can't see. Back up. There, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> There's your thumbnail. Oh my god. All right, oh this is shoot. Called? Fiery butt death. I like it. I'm in. Ha! Uh -oh. We have two wings left, folks. It happened. Um, which one? What's this number? I thought I was touching myself with a clean. You touch tissue. your eye, dude. I don't know, it just started burning. This one's trying to have flavor. I need a neti pot. You right, buddy? Why yeah, you it was a clean napkin, I don't understand. Why are you taking your pants off? <laughs> <laughs> Refreshing. No, oh, it's not. It's this miserable. Clean, cleans out the senses. I got. I have it in my nose. Like I, I have it in my nose. In my nose. All right. You ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna ask it from in here. Oh, let him come out here. You're gonna like this one, Skiz. Okay. This is a fun one. Okay, I gotta eat. Go ahead. <clears throat> What's your favorite line from any movie? Oh God. <clears throat> Because if you need some help, I can rattle off some movies just to give you some samples if you need a little expert in the situation. <laughs> All right. Favorite line. Up through my mouth into my eyeball. I'm Favorite line. Jeff Goldblum as Ian Malcolm in Jurassic Park. Your scientists are too preoccupied with whether or not they could, they don't stop to think if they should. That's a good line. That's my favorite line. <laughs> Uh, yeah. What's yours? I can't think. Swap me places. Get over here. Come on. Yeah. You gotta get on camera. Oh, no. This isn't. This isn't good. Look at these guys. Hi, everybody. Uh. Everybody else too afraid to be on camera. Come on, there, little buckaroo. My eyes. We still got one to go. Dude, it got. It somehow got my eyes. I don't <coughs> know. This is exactly what we're worried about. What was the question? Uh, what's your favorite line from any movie? Whew. Let's see. PC load letter. <laughs> <laughs> and the following line after that. Yes. Uh, yeah, that was pretty good. I got nothing. Right. I got nothing. Uh, I have to eat this though. Yeah. Mine, mine is uh, Val Kilmer Tombstone. I'm your Uncle Barry. Oh, good one. I mean, he's got like my top five favorites, but. Mm. But it's got a very good I'm, one. I like it. In fact, I want to. I really want to watch Tombstone again. I haven't seen it in at least five years, and it's probably my top three favorite movies. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Let me see your eyebrow. Yeah. You're in a bad way. Yeah. Right, just let's, some let's water. Do clean tissue. Taylor just gave it to me. I don't understand. I'm gonna Google how to take care of this, buddy. 
says here, stop you, eating. You have, <laughs> you have to pee in your eye. <laughs> uh, that's a guy. It's like when you get stung by a jellyfish. I'll save yeah. you. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Mrs. T, what did Mrs. T say? Rinse your eyes with warm water. Yeah. If you wear contact lessons, you don't. While well, your eyes may burn for up to an hour, yeah. the pain will fade with time. If it persists after an hour, call a medical professional. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. Yeah. It feels great. You guys will love this. This is great. I'm ready. We have one wing left. I'm just, so proud of us. Just ignore the fact that my eyes are bloodshot red now. Yeah. Let this me, is, this is the look. last one. The last time. Yeah, I got you. It got me. I don't know how. It happens. I that guess. happened. No, I, I, you're Woo, worse I think it came up the mouth into the no, eyeball. I put my finger in my nose. Oh, who has the last question? Uh, oh, oh the, chat. Oh, chat does. We got to do the dab. You going to do it? Yeah, we dab it up. Yeah, I mean a clean. Is that, dude, we have one wing left, and then we've done this thing legit. I'm afraid, though. Like, I don't want to touch the wing anymore. Want me to baby Woo. bird you? Baby bird me? Yeah. The oh last dab, dude. It's the last dab. That's tradition, right? You gotta yeah, dab yeah. it up. Yep. Dab it up. I want more. Tango's, Tango's a man. Beast. I cannot believe that went in my eyeball. I'm so mad. I, I'm feel for you. Dude. Get a little cozy here. Sorry. Woo! Look at that, look at that one. <laughs> You'll shoot your eye out, kid. All right, we got the last dab. Who's, uh, what's, this? what's the question? Yeah, do we have a question for this? Can, uh, Hanna, you got another question for us? Do I want my milkshake? I have a question if not, but. But if I'd, I'd rather All go right, ahead. while while you're waiting, I'm gonna go ahead and dig in. Okay. I'm gonna eat. Oh, we're doing it all at the same time? Yeah. yeah let's do it. All right, yeah. Woo! If content creation is relatively more enjoyable than a day job, how much better? Ah. Oh, who is? Uh, hold on. Ah! Stop talking. <laughs> What's the point? Again, of? again. Oh my god. <clears throat> That's a question I need. Milkshake. <sighs> on it one more time, if you can. If content creation were, is relatively more enjoyable than a day job, how much better or worse is it in terms of pay versus stress? Oh my gosh. Good freaking question. Well, I can answer since I'm <coughs> uh -oh. still got a foot in both camps. <laughs> I'm gonna, can I answer this with one eyeball open? <laughs> Put milk in the eye. Uh, just just hand uh, me the box, dude. My, my, <laughs> yeah. my answer Quick is gonna be a little bit. My answer, like a whole, shut up. My answer oh. is gonna be a little bit different because <clears throat> they're they're full time and I have a foot in both camps. I'm full time tech and I'm I have like wings and like doing everything I can in the content creation. Uh, so far, my worst day in content creation is better than my best day in, at, at, at Intel. That's the where answer. I work. You all know that now. Yeah, and, and I get paid yeah. very very well. And I I would I I love what I do. I really love the people I work with. I can't complain. I'm given tremendous freedom. But my worst day in content creation is better than my best day in a day. There's nothing yeah. you need to say. I, I'd agree yeah. with that. I think um, one thing for me is like obviously, any, and this probably goes for anybody that like owns your own business is like you constantly have the stress of making sure your business is doing well, that you're going to be able to continue owning that business, putting food on the table, and all that stuff. So it's constantly on your mind. You're constantly stressed about it. But like Skiz said. I wouldn't trade that to, to go back to, you know, like the regular desk Not job that I had before years. this. Just no. it's it's because this is this is what I love to do. I love yeah. I love making content. It makes me feel good to put a video out and have people enjoy it. And it just fills me up. Like that's what it is. It fills my cup. Yeah. So all, my cup. all the all the stress, you know, even if I wasn't even if I was only making enough money to just barely survive, I would still, still. do I, it I would over do it a less. job that paid twice as much. I would do it for less, yeah. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. yeah. That's right. For me that's, it's that's it's that. knowing that and this is one of the things I hated about the desk job was at the desk job, it doesn't matter really how good you are or how creative you are or or what amazing improvement you came up with. It's just, it doesn't help you. Yeah. It helps the man, you know? Yeah. yeah. And now with this job, every critical decision we make makes, it's just 100% impacts right back on us. Yeah. Ooh, I just snorted in something. Oh. That was good. It's so it, every every decision feels so much more impactful, so much more meaningful, and so much more 
just yeah. from the heart because you're like this is me this is this is this is my life and it makes the difference it's a hundred percent the results that i will receive or not receive yeah you know better or worse i like that i um, do i like that a lot i'm the, with you man and then, but the other thing the downside i would say to this is <clears throat> and i think maybe i put this on myself more than i should i know i do is the, the guilt and that might sound weird at first but it's the guilt of not being able to separate right you go to your desk job you leave you come home you crack a beer you're not thinking about your desk right. job yeah. yeah you can turn it off you know easily i right i i can't turn it off and anytime <clears throat> anytime i try to turn it off i have the guilt that i shouldn't be turning it off right yeah. you know and it's like well no one you know when you go home for your day job no one's expecting you to work and there's, and there's no loss <laughs> right when you when you stop working this job Technically, there's loss. True. You know? Yeah. It's, it's the... Yeah. And, that, and that goes for any self... I, I have yeah, yeah, inappropriate yeah, yeah. things dripping out of my nose. It, it's, just, it's just part of self-employment. Yeah. Like, if you take a vacation, you're actually... Like, it's a double whammy, right? Right. You're paying for your vacation, and you're losing money because you're not right. working. You're making making right. content or, or even right. you know producing whatever it is you, you do as a, as a self-employed uh, business owner. So yeah, there is that. There's there's always that, and then there's always the fear that it's going to be gone tomorrow. No hiccups. I don't understand. I think it's because the reason I didn't get hiccups is because it was gradual. I think oh. if I if I put this one like like you said, this was right around where hot wings start. Yeah. If I just put one of those in my mouth, I probably would have hiccuped. But I think because it was gradual, I didn't. I didn't. Have I get that. my milkshake now. I'll tell you what. Milkshake. Like, we did learn our lesson. Milkshake. The bomb beyond <coughs> sanity is. The worst thing you could ever put in your mouth. Yeah. Like, I just need to show there was here. there was nothing here. Look at these guys blocking there, the camera. There, hold on, wait. Don't focus. you be ripping. There's a pulses, oh, it doesn't focus. <laughs> Good. Oh, because my face is in cam. That's why. Block my face. And then there's block, my block, block, block my face. Oh. <laughs> you shut up, Tango. You shut up, my dog. Hey, some of those wings you showed, I ate the other side of them. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. I ate the other half. I don't know what happened with the the bomb beyond insanity. Somehow I'm li uh, I'm telling you, I had a clean I've been tissue. To this I don't understand. Oh, Culver shake. Be jealous. It's good now though. I'm fine now. So yeah, Tango's Did you just say be invited. jealous. <laughs> okay, so here's here's the uh, here's the question of the day. Are you ready? So we all just found out the bomb beyond insanity is the dumbest thing anybody could ever put in their mouth. How much? They, they With, should have sorted those differently, because you're right, that was... It, that was it should have been the last one. Like, literally, after that, even the last dab was easy. Yeah, it was. And not easy, but you know, it hurt. Well, it but. didn't add any... It was coated with worse. Mm -hmm. So there's like, what's... So, I didn't even feel bad from that one, yeah. How much would somebody have to pay you to take a spoonful of the bomb <clears throat> beyond insanity? Oh, that I was didn't break it off! That milkshake just brought... <coughs> just brought... It was like, oh, I'm gonna bring everything that's in your mouth and just, yeah, that was. What's all this static? That's, that's okay. the spiciest. Tango, thing. we're not competing. There's I not know, a competition, drink, but, but Tango did definitely hold his own better than uh, the rest of us. I think I was okay until it got in my eyeball. <clears throat> I don't know how you didn't like go a to your water. Spoonful. Ever. Listen, I was fine until I got my eye. I would, I would. Which one is it? It's not the emotion. It's this one. I would do it, except I would have health concerns. Do what? Like a whole spoonful. Yeah. Oh. How much would somebody have to pay you to take I mean, I wouldn't do it for free. I wouldn't do it for free. Full spoon. But I wouldn't be that afraid of it. Uh. There's, there's health concerns of like. Pika Pika being amazing. $102. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you. Split three ways. All right. Thank you so much. We will do that. Thank you. Jeez. Like I said, yeah, I'll, I'll I, try to take a minute to I read. think if you took a spoonful of this, you would probably need to go to the hospital. Like, I'm not even like making a joke. Like, that's. No, you I would, think you would be, yeah. you'd be in some serious trouble. Yeah. No. Yeah. Thanks for the shakes. Yeah. I I wasn't, I I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to come back and finish after I got my eye. That was that was crazy. Yeah, dude. That's that was some resilience right there. Yeah, we need to uh Yeah, it'll be okay. It's fine now. We need to wash like red, I'm sure. I, have you guys washed your hands? I washed them like crazy after it got my eye. <laughs> um that was not fun. That was not fun. That that was the main concern. That's why we did popcorn chicken to begin <coughs> with. I wanna wash my hands. So we wouldn't have now, to touch the wings. Tomorrow morning, do we want to have a discussion about that? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. Not really. I mean, whoo! Let me tell you though, Mrs. T, we got a date in the morning. I do. I do like. I do like hot sauces. And like you said, about to the fun. point you get to to here, uh, it's not so much fun. I am 
going to like reuse the first five, like and just like mm -hmm. regular family night wings. Like I, like the, <clears throat> the the back half. I think I might just. Throw I away. think I think I would, I would, enjoyably. Up to here, up to right before the bomb. I would I would like to have them. And yeah. Then, well, here's the thing. I, if I want to do this again, I want to I want to I want to do this. Ah. I want to do this. Just just resort them by resort what it, it actually because felt this one, like. The last dab wasn't. It was just a non. Yeah. There was nothing there, and it would have been better if it went this way. I think. Yeah. So did the. Uh, Everyone says the last dab. Oh, there's a poll right, right now deciding who broke first. If you could take the fact that I put it in my eyeball out we, of the mix, really think about that. We all really think about that. We all made it. Nobody broke. Yeah. Thank you. I think they're talking about because I took a sip of water first. I didn't think that was pretty. Oh, my cheek is burning. Oh, that's not good. That means something's close to my eye. I um, I drank the most milk. <laughs> Hope, hopefully one day, Ken Senior. I blacked out. That's true. <laughs> I was the first one to eat. That's the thing. I was the first one to eat. Right, Pebbles? The Beyond Insanity to bomb. Kept it together. I was the first one to eat that one. So yeah, I guess so. That yeah, one. You guys feel like they set me up. Once you wash your hands, the spice isn't gonna come off. It's like in your skin. It's yes. Gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna, one molecule in your. Yes. Blood. Yes. I one time, dude. I was camping, and I <clears throat> cut up jalapenos for breakfast, and then later, <laughs> I went to the bathroom. And I, for the longest time, I thought that a spider bit my. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I was. Yeah. Like, yeah it's but. gonna be literally. So chat's saying like we gotta do this more often, not eat the wings, but like we should get together. Uh, we could easily play some. Guys, we could sit here and play video games yeah. like on this big TV in front of us, and they would love it. Yeah. <laughs> dude, seriously, three-way rock. We could do right this here, so easily, way more often. This setup's not bad, right? It's a little echoey, right? It's a little echoey when in this room. Shouting, it doesn't matter, does it? But like we could do this setup so easily more often. Yeah. And We're next time let's more. not stick hot sauce more. in our eyeballs. I just washed my hands like four times. They're into it. So yeah. who won the NJ, thank you so much for the fifteen dollars. Who won the uh the little who broke first? It was me, wasn't it? No, it was me. Breaking. Because I had water before anybody. If that's what is is breaking. They had a pole. They had a pole. I'm sure it's me. I don't know what breaking is. I got through it all. Oh, got up first. Nobody, standing up is oh. breaking. Yeah, they, everyone ate the wings. Breaking would have been like nobody oh, broke. No, I can't. Oh, I it was a yeah, prediction. Exactly. I'm breaking done. Would have been tapping that would have been broken. It was a prediction. Wait, I won the prediction. As in, like more, more, oh. most people said that I was gonna break first. <laughs> is that what that is? <laughs> was that Dragon Lady something? That was incredible. Tango is ridiculous. Skiz broke Tango one hands down. Shut up! It's not a competition. <laughs> Tango, I, I knew you could handle spice. I didn't know you were that good. Yeah, dude, you didn't touch your water at all. What is he that? Was, he was on, on a mission to prove something <laughs> today. It, he it was, was definitely on a mission. It was to myself. I always wanted to see if I could do this. Yeah, you nailed it, bro. You, you did great. Um, <clears throat> we, we did it, though. I mean, we should all be proud of it. Yes. This is not easy to even get through. I was and, really uh, worried I was not going to be able to get through it. And that. we got we got yeah. through it. Did you enjoy it? Mm -hmm. I enjoyed the, the first, first half five, an hour. <laughs> yeah. It was far where it was tasty. Yeah. It was fun. Definitely fun. I, I loved it. It was great. <laughs> we got through it. I'm going to see if I can pull up uh, this my all the donations and bits and stuff. I'm seeing some stuff at the top just because they're like super chats. This milkshake uh, is And we can see those. Right so like, thank you guys mm -hmm. so much for that. But uh, I don't have a good way of like seeing all the activity. It's been going on, so I want to make sure I can pull that up real quick. I'm still kind of crying a little bit, to be honest. Tells, thank oh, you. On. Saddlebags. Come in. I'm going to log in here. You're just upset because your stupid little pebble theory didn't work out, and you don't know how to express your anger. Yeah, what? and you're ugly. <laughs> Who can name that? <laughs> uh, that sounded like a quote, yeah. Some of you going to get that. Who's going to name it first? Oh, man. You don't know how to express your anger. Oh, yeah, and you're ugly. I can't pull it up. Nobody. It's already happened. There's no I'm way. Gonna, I'm gonna have to like go. I'm gonna have to go over there and read. You guys. No one's got it. Ace Ventura. Oh. <clears throat> Let me get up. Skiz. What's up, buddy? I've never seen Ace Ventura. Oh. Oh. Um. Side topic. Played up. Off. We're not playing it. Nor are we ever playing it again. All those things I said about Tiger before the show. I retract them. Yeah. <laughs> 
No. <laughs> right, Honestly, I don't know if you would like it. They're gonna hear me from the, the background. Can but... you slide the chat over so we're not staring at your butt? Yeah. I mean, a little bit of both. Wait, do I? <laughs> a little bit of column. <laughs> a little bit of both. A little column A, a little column B. <clears throat> Ooh, so hurting. What was that fancy thing you just did there? Ooh, fancy thing. You're like a Windows nerd. What did you just do? <laughs> Uh, if you hover over, like, the <laughs> Windows guy, nerd. You see, it gives you options to, like, split the screen. Is that a standard Windows thing? It's new, yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> um, all right, let me read some of these off. Teddy Cat Derp, thank you so much for the 500 bits. <laughs> uh, since the three of you appreciate dad jokes, here's a joke for the day. An old man was working out at the gym when he spotted a young, hot girl walking in. He asked the trainer standing next to him, what machine should I use to impress that girl over there? The trainer looked him up and down and said, I would recommend the ATM yeah, in the lobby. I saw that coming, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got some super chats. Hazy Cash, Teller Rain, Glow Boxer, Hannibal, Dragon, uh, Lady uh, uh, USPS, NJ Coffee Junkie. Thank you guys so much for the super chats. Those are the ones we could like, see on our little chat screen, so appreciate that. Let me see. What are they? <laughs> Like, yeah, yeah. Hand me that box here right there. Uh, so if you go to Heat Mist, just keep fixing chat. Oh, click just click the chat window. My bad. How'd that happen? I must have accidentally clicked it. Uh, if you go to heatmist.com, you can get the entire kit. Uh, I think you, you can pick whatever season you want. The current season is season uh, 21 of the Hot Ones. Comes in a box like this. Ten sauces come in. Their whole lineup that's on the show, one through ten. Uh, and then if you if you want to you want to hurt yourself, uh, I did just find this on on Amazon, the the regular Da Bomb Beyond Insanity. So yeah, it's uh, it was like a hundred and I think I paid hundred and ten plus shipping and, and tax. Yeah, I, don't know. Oh, I don't know what's wrong with him. <laughs> Bexton, thanks for the ten. Tiny Python, come on. It takes the pain away from my mouth. You want to try it? <coughs> no. This reminds me of when Skiz and I were in uh, <coughs> Don't bring up this in, in college, and we were taking an exam in a computer lab. And uh, the exam was that we were supposed to write blackjack program in, uh, what was it, C++? And uh, Skiz couldn't get his blackjack program to work. It's missing a semicolon. So instead of uh, <laughs> sitting there trying to figure out he made a fist, and he just started whacking himself <laughs> over the head. Bang! 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 So the whole class is quiet trying to write code, and all you hear is Skiz's fist cracking yeah. his skull. And this is a big fist, dude. And I look over at him to say, dude, what are you doing? 
And just outside the big old window is basically a fishbowl for a lab. Is an entire high school class of students who were on a tour, <laughs> <laughs> trying to decide if this college is going to be their college of choice. As they look in and watch Skiz banging himself with his fist over and over again, and I see the look on their faces like, I don't yeah, think yeah. I want to go here. I made eye contact. I made eye contact with one of them, and I was like. <laughs> Oh, so I no. see some people talking about like one chip challenge. There's other there's these other ones that are crazy, like the yeah. jelly bean. What's the one whatever. chip challenge? I had a bunch of those, quite honestly, what's and up, I was Jeff? And I was like, "What's up, Jeff? How you doing?" <laughs> and I was like researching them. All the research I did of people who did them said, "It it's you know like this was like oh that was spicy though oh, woo he those are like oh I'm injured you know oh. I'm, they're they're just not." But the I, chip like, itself is yeah, spicy? Yeah, I, I like threw them out, yeah, because it's just like... It's like a live scorpion on I, I feel like the spice <laughs> I could handle, but just what it would do to me is not yeah. something I would want to do, so pass on those. So yeah. we're going to pass on the, on the chip. I, I don't know. Oh, you I can mean, do it. I'm the bomb it, yeah. beyond insanity, that was, I've, that's enough for me. That, that, thing was, that was stupid. That was the one yeah. that was just this like, I'm, everybody. I'm done now. I don't, everybody I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't need this in my life anymore. I'm going to throw it out the window. That was bad. This I, is, I, honestly, I, I don't want, encourage anybody to do this. Well, what one, I want to do is I want to make that really good dip I make with cream cheese and salsa, and I want to put like a dollop of that in it and just mix it through. But there's no flavor. Thing. Huh? Like, yeah. going to give it some more. There's no flavor. No, nah, you know what? I would You're do. better off adding more of I like would. One of these. Yeah. yeah. I'd go with this guy. I think this guy actually would have flavor if it wasn't so hot. The, uh... Alchemy watermelon ghost one. What was the cinnamon one? I did the not. Cinnamon, the cinnamon one, one was. Oh, the that's the spicy best. shark. That was brutal. That was my favorite one. Really? I, that yeah. was my least. Favorite that's when it. That's when it started to get uh, like. I thought that, I was like cinnamon on a wing. Oh I've my never gosh. seen that before or tasted that. Blue Fox good. Gaming, thank you so much. Four hundred and eighty. What? Is that is that euros? Like. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's a lot. Oh my gosh. Blue Fox. That's wow. insane. Thank you so much. Blue Holy Fox. smokes. That's a cool name. That's, that's, I sat back down so I can't see the other stuff Blue coming Fox in. Blue Fox has been amazing. But thank you guys I'll so much. I'll let six months to yes. Jeez. Yeah. That was, that was fun. I mean, obviously, you know, we got ourselves a little set up here and, and, uh, it was funny. Everybody, everybody chipped in. Skiz, uh, went and picked up some shakes. Tango went and picked up some milk. And buck 41 for the milk. Yeah. I got, I got the wings. Um, yeah, I just, the wings were easy. I didn't trouble my wife at all. I just got Buffalo Wild Wings last night and. Got well, I got like forty naked wings, you know, no sauce or right, anything right. like that. Um, I, yeah, and the reason I got forty is because, like, you know how like, sometimes you get those weird wings that are like not full wings and weird, you know. Yeah. So I got some extras just no, in they, case. They were, they're perfect. Well, I'll tell you this. Uh, this was this was a lot of fun. Not just the wing thing, but <clears throat> getting together with you two and doing something like we've done this before, but it's been yeah. a long time. It's been like yeah. been since Beam days, right? Yeah. yeah, we got yeah. Yeah, we can easily Seriously. just get together and sit Let's here and, and have controllers. We got a big old TV right in front of us. We could easily game and in the stream. So yeah. this has kind of proved that like we can make this and, a thing and more often. Pretty much got the best setup ever here, like the <laughs> professional <laughs> level stuff. Here. It's so it's <laughs> crazy. Tango walked in and and uh, there's a, a boom arm with a like microphone. His mic arm looks and like. And he's like, whoa. He, he could like. <laughs> What the? That's new. Pick up cars. Skins with didn't that even thing. notice. <laughs> <laughs> it's been here the whole time. Yeah, like but the, it wasn't the here last time. And everything. Right? We used it yeah. for when we recorded the podcast. Oh, it's the one. same one. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. I don't remember being silver. It's beefy though, isn't it? It is, super it is beefy. like. It doesn't look like a boom arm. It it's like, like a full a studio. I can grab it and like. Yeah, there's a literally a microphone a right. See how my fingers going off screen? Screen right here. <laughs> it's like yeah. boom. I can almost touch it. Yeah. So we'll do more. We just got to figure out the format and. Yeah. You know what it is. Games. No, Joker is what? You know, not, he's Joker's in California. Stage. Yeah. Yeah. So it'd be a bit of a drive for him to make it. But yeah, three of us. And honestly, oh, like the with, are starting. with this shot, this is about as tight as we can get. We're we're almost shoulder to shoulder, you know? That's fine. Okay. So but yeah, we could sit here with, with some controllers and, you could, you and could stuff. Back the camera up. I'd be totally down for that, dude. Mm -hmm. Every once in a while. Yeah, or even a board game with a camera up here or yeah. whatever. Could do, a, could do an overhead cam easily. So. Again, we did all that, remember? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> we nice. still have the table. The, the yeah, we trapezoid. made it. We handmade the yeah. table. The yeah. trapezoid table, because we were having this issue of how are we going to sit yeah. so that we can all face yeah. but not be weird. And So, yeah, yeah, we literally cut a table into a trapezoid, and then we covered it with felt. 
Yeah. We had like a blue felt yeah. on it so that the cards and stuff. Some of you guys remember that, I'm sure. <laughs> I still have it. It's in my garage. Yeah. A long time ago. <laughs> we could pull that out. Remember, yeah. yeah, we cut that table. We put the carpet on it. We fold it underneath, stapled it in. Like we made like a nice yeah. kind of yeah. semi-professional And table. we were in a different room from where like my whole computer setup was. So what we did, instead of moving the whole computer, we got a fire hose of cables. USB, HDMI, all sorts of stuff. Yep. And we'd hook it into the computer in one room and run it like 40 feet into crazy. another room yeah. and hook all the stuff up. We don't need to do that anymore. <laughs> Times have changed. So, yeah. yeah, this time, this entire stream was done from a laptop. That's what it should be. So, yeah, yeah there's just a little laptop over yep. in the corner there. It is screaming. I don't know if you can hear it. Like, it's screaming. The fan is going crazy, but it held up. But it's fine. It held up for at least the hour and 20 minutes that we've been live today. So, we could use this too. I bet you can pipe something. Yeah, I could put something. We got a TV off to here. the side. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a very <laughs> Yeah, Zephanie's coming town again, and we'll get a Zitz stream that going. That would be oh, amazing. Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. I don't know why we had chat on the other side now. Do you think, do you think Zed would have done this challenge? Ooh. He would have done it, but he would have had trouble with it. Would he? Yeah. He's not into spices. Nah. I, I liked when dude. Zed brought, like, Marmalade and stuff, and it was just so gross. Oh, it was vile. <laughs> I would, I would do a spoonful of that before I did some of the that really marmite. Oh. Marmite. What did I say? Marmalade. Whatever it is, it's just <laughs> not even. Yeah. Is 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 not meant to be. Yeah. Is not meant to be consumed. Even. Feels like. Oh my gosh. Anybody in chat going to TwitchCon in October? Put your hands up. Vegemite. That's the other one. Yeah. Vegemite. Yeah. I mixed up whatever the Marmite, Marmite one and Vegemite. <laughs> well, Marmite and Marmalade are not the same. No, we know. I want to... Mix them together. Oh, we got some people going to TwitchCon. Maybe. We're, we're going to be there. A lot of I want to, yeah. The three of us are going. Uh, Which, we will be there... Friday, Saturday, at least, and then maybe yeah. part of Sunday, I don't know. I have no idea what to expect. I don't either. Like, I've never been. Walk around and see what happens, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Let's go to TwitchCon. Let's yeah. do something, yeah. And are we, we're driving, right? We're driving up. Yeah. yeah. Driving up. Uh, yep, MCC Live was announced. Um, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> I can't say much more than that. Uh, we'll see. We might get to check it out. Height train in They want it. They want to know how tall we are. Oh, Should we stand I'm the, up? I'm the shortest. Yeah. I don't know. Aren't you guys the same my, height? You got me by half huh? inch, I think. I'm the shortest one here. Yeah, yeah. Skiz is a little guy. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Are we standing up to show them for real? It's your call. All right, fine. <laughs> here you go. This is weird. Am I off? We're off camera. It doesn't. Oh help. yeah. It doesn't <laughs> help. If, it doesn't help if we're too tall for the camera. Oh, you look way taller than me now. Oh, you got shoes on. That's why. I got shoes. Why every, all right, all right. I'll take yeah. my shoes every off. Every picture I'm in, I look there like Hagrid. There you go. There you go. We can't tell because our heads are off camera. Our heads are off camera, but they can tell by, <laughs> by where our eyes are. It looks are. a lot more than that. Skiz is completely... Skiz is just like... <laughs> and I'm leaving, too. <laughs> can you imagine... Skiz is a monster. Can you imagine yeah. Mumbo or Doc? The, the, the top of the TV would be like right yeah. here. On the <laughs> That's so here. funny that we're off camera when we stand. Oh, man. <laughs> How tall is Skiz? He's six foot two. Uh, Tango, you're what? Five, five, seven and a half, yeah. five, eight, somewhere maybe close. Maybe five, eight, yeah. I'm probably five, eight, maybe eight and a half. I don't know. Oh, man. I'm not, I'm not okay. tall by any means. Skiz dwarfs tall himself. human again, dude. And yeah, me too. So, I, I didn't think I was coming back from that eyeball thing. I remember when you and I first did this, we were having the shake during it. Yeah, and even, that makes even, sense. That's cheating. Yeah. Even then, and I, we didn't know, but even yeah. then, I had like this much left, and I was yeah. like, yeah, I don't know how to finish it. What I'm most concerned about is the fact that I I drink this whole thing because I don't, I don't handle it. You don't do it. sweet. Yeah, yeah. I don't just there goes well. your plate upstream. In fact, no, um, we're, we're doing it. You guys okay. start in one hour, so yeah. should, we should we let these guys yes. go so they can make it home yes, and, and put, put on another stream for you guys today? Wait. Should we let them go? <laughs> should we let them go play plate up? Join that, us for plate after, up. After we plated <laughs> up our own yes. stuff today. This is awesome. This is great. I love playing plate up. All right, I'll let them go. All right, guys. It was super fun hanging out. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for all the support and, yes. and uh, watching us suffer. We will do uh, this again. Some you guys are all some format. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Maybe not eat the wings, but we'll, no, we'll definitely some, get some together. Sort of yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, we'll figure it out now that we know it works. Yeah. So, 
Um, all right, guys. Uh, thanks. I'm I'm gonna literally send you to a different screen just so that we can I can <laughs> from his phone. How cool Here we go. Here we go. Ready? It's gonna say uh, be right back, but it's a lie. It's We're not so gonna. Oh, cool. These two will be right back on their so own Twitch cool. channels. You're not that cool. And we'll see you guys again <laughs> You're not later. Not that cool. Yeah, cool. All right. Yeah.